Hey there, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, thank you so much for subscribing. Leave a like or a comment. Right now, I'm just showing my braid pattern and it's the same for every single install that I do. I'm going to be recreating this look and I call this unit my bedroom boom unit because it's very sexy and very grown up. In this video, I'm going to be showing a completely glueless wig install. When you purchase a lace from my website, they already come pre-plugged. But in this second video, I'm showing how I went and plugged more. My customer wanted a thinner hairline. I've already bleached the knots, and if you haven't already, please go watch my video of me properly bleaching knots. And right now, I'm showing you guys the makeup technique. Even though this is a glueless install, you still have to do that step in order to blend the cap with the wig and with their skin. This is a full lace wig and this particular pattern shown in this video, it has to be requested by the customer. The only way to achieve this look properly, you have to get this particular wave pattern and you can purchase at hairbyericaj.com. And right now I'm just getting the wig prepared for styling and molding processing. After the mousse, I would use water. Whenever you're molding down a client, you're gonna use mousse. But for this particular wet look, you have to mix it in with water. I'm cutting the baby hairs right now, and after I cut the baby hairs, I'm just gonna start to cut the wig. The way you're gonna cut this wig for this shortcut look is in a layered style. Please pay attention to how I'm holding the eyebrow cutter. Whether you're gonna use an eyebrow cutter or a razor comb, whatever is comfortable for you, please use that. particular pattern has to be requested by the customer. This is a 14 inch full lace wig and the wave pattern is natural wave. This has to be requested by the customer. Someone asked me why would I use a 14 inch wig for this particular look? That's a great question. My vendor only sells this wave pattern in 14 inch or longer. You can purchase a 8 inch full lace wig, but it's only going to be straight or body wave. After you finish cutting and you're happy with your look, you're going to start the molding process. Please keep in mind that I said this is a glueless install. Her wig is still not glued down. Her lace is still not cut off yet. So right now, you're gonna use the mousse as well as the water and start to comb the hair in the way that you want it to lay. In every video, if you haven't noticed, I like to switch it up sometimes and do different techniques for you guys. Right now, for the baby hairs, I'm showing just mousse and water technique. Please pay attention and I'm gonna zoom in for you.
that is so I can make the curls a little more defined. When you start to comb the hair, you're going to start to see it lay down flat, which is why I'm patting on it and making the curls pop out a little more. And if you need to, go ahead and shape it up a little bit more. After you have finished the molding process, you will then wrap your customer's hair down and sit them under the dryer. These head wraps can be purchased at HairByErikaJ.com and if not, you can go to your local beauty supply store and use the paper wraps. Once you take the head wrap off, it'll be completely laid and after that, you're going to go in and cut the lace off. If you haven't forgotten by now, or if you have forgotten, I'm going to remind you that this is a completely glueless wig install. In order for you to have results that you are happy with, you have to mold your customer's hair down for any glueless install. To get rid of that super laid baby hair look, you can use a small tooth comb and just comb them out a little bit. I hope you're happy with these results. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Feel free to try this technique at home and if you have any inquiries about purchases or if you need help with anything, follow me on Instagram and all of my contact info is on there. Thank you guys for watching and thank you for the continuous support.